Good morning, State Representative William Pettit here. I represent the 22nd District, which is the town of Plainville and the west side of the city of New Britain. So, welcome. Today we're working on reading, or in your case, perhaps listening to a story and deciding what you'd like to read and what you're interested in. I thought it's been kind of a long time with the pandemic and the winter that I would actually jump ahead to a book that I loved when I was a kid called Summer. I think this came out when I was seven years old. It's by a lady by the name of Alice Lowe, illustrated by Roy McKee. Summer. We like things that summer brings. It brings the sun, it brings the heat, it brings us things we like to eat, like watermelon. Summer brings so many things. We like to ride way out of town. We like to ride uphill and down. It feels so good when we go fast. We like to feel the breeze go past. And there they are on their bikes. You can tell it's 1963 because they don't have their bike helmets on. Now when you go out riding, you have to have your bike helmets on. We ride and ride about a mile, and then we stop and eat a while. We like cold things. We eat them up, and when we eat, so does our pup. So what can you think of that's cold in the summer? That's right, ice cream. You can have snow cones and slushies, all sorts of great things. We like the things that summer brings. It brings us fireworks late at night, all red and yellow, blue and white. They go up high, they are such fun. Look, look, there goes another one. What's the holiday in the middle of the summer that we celebrate with fireworks? Come on, 4th of July, that's right, Independence Day. Some summer days we take a ride, the car gets very hot inside, and when we sit in all that heat, we wish that we had used our feet. I mean, there's people sweating in their cars, but again, this was written in 1963, almost nobody had air conditioning in their cars back then. Pretty much everybody does now, so we're much cooler now. At last we are no longer hot. Cold water cools us off a lot. It cools us off down to our toes. Our pup is going to cool his nose. So they're in a little pond with a little waterfall there. Remember, you always go swimming with a buddy. You swim in places where you have adults or lifeguards there, okay? Be safe. Summer brings so many things. Summer brings us rides on swings. We swing a pine through the trees. We swing so fast we make a breeze. Now I know you all love to do that out on the playground. Swing as high as you can on the swing. I love it. The older you get, it gets tougher though. I get dizzy when I do it too much with my son. Then down we go into some hay. We like to play this game all day. And I guess you're out by a farm somewhere. We have some farms surrounding us and they're jumping in stacks of hay that they're going to use to feed the farm animals. Summer brings us things with wings. We like to catch them with a net and see how many we can get. And here they are chasing after butterflies. Sometimes in the summertime you'll see we don't see as many uh, monarchs, the orange and black butterflies, but there's swallowtails and a lot of other butterflies, so see how many you can find this summer. In the summertime we say hello to all the fish way down below. They look at us, they seem to say what kind of fish have come our way. And here they are snorkeling, and you probably have snorkeled, you can snorkel in a pool or when you go to the beach with a little mouthpiece and a little uh, mask to protect your eyes. A summer fair, a fair is fun, in summertime we go to one, around and round and around we go, the ground is very far below, they're on the ferris wheel. I don't like heights, so my son always wants to go on those things, so I have to close my eyes and have him protect me. Summer brings garden fun, we have to water well we know to make our garden grow and grow. There they are with their flowers, and that's what we do, we do a lot of flowers in our yard. Not too many vegetables, a lot of people have vegetable gardens, so See if you can work with your mom and dad and work in the garden this year. It's kind of fun. Grow sunflowers. You can take a little teeny tiny seed and you can grow a 10 or 12 foot sunflower by August, September. You water me, I water you, and that will make us grow fast too. I think they're just, just kidding. It's a hot day and they're having fun squirting each other with the hoses. Some summer nights we cook and eat. Our pup is not so very neat. What are they making? What are those called? Anybody? S'mores. So they're taking marshmallows and getting some graham crackers and some chocolate, putting them together. We like the things the summer brings. We like to fish with sticks and strings. We sit and sit. We wish and wish that we could catch just one small fish. 
They're on a very high pier trying to fish. There's a lot of places to fish around here. There's ponds right in town. You can go over to the Farmington River and fish. Some days we catch one 10 feet long and 10 feet fish are big and strong. They get away, they take our hook. We never take them home to cook. I don't think we're going to catch any 10 feet fishes in our lakes and ponds around here. You're going to have to go out to the ocean to catch one of those. We like to spend a day this way. We make a sand house on the shore. We make some windows and a door. The waves come up fast. They come up. Sometimes our sand house does not last, but there's lots of sand to dig to make another just as big. So there they are on the beach. A lot of people here will go to Rocky Neck or Hammonasset, over to Rhode Island to Squamaket and make sand castles and collect shells and it's a lot of fun. When we go out on summer nights we see fireflies with their lights. We catch them. They give us light to find our way back home at night. There they are out in the field catching fireflies. They have a little chemical reaction thereby that causes that little glow that you see. We ask a farmer, will you stop and let us ride back home on top? And there they are, talking to the farmer and trying to hop on for a little ride home. We let the fireflies go away, the moon is out, it lights our way. We hear the horse go clop, 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 our pup goes fast asleep on top. We stay awake and think of things, the happy things that summer brings. She's letting all the fireflies out so they can go back home as well. Summer's a lot of fun, so maybe you can talk with your teachers about what things you love about the summer and you can take a look at this book. So, Summer by Alice Lowe. Thank you for listening.